2020 by the time you're gonna see this video and I finally have my stand set up and my light so <laughs> I hope these are a little less nauseating than watching me make videos in my car so we are doing a <clears throat> unboxing video for Christmas my husband got me a subscription to Lunarly which is like it's, it's self-care boxes and they come every new moon. So this is my Lunarly box. It's beautiful. Um, they are not a sponsor yet, but I really love everything in the subscription box. This is my first box and I'm really excited for a full year getting the boxes every new moon. Yeah, so I've been doing new moon intentions for a while. Um, probably back to 2013 is when I started getting really interested in the moon and stuff with my girlfriend Chrissy. I love you Chrissy. Um, and since then my obsession and interest with the moon has grown. I'm sorry, there is Beauty and the Beast on in the background. Be our guest. So I've been doing Newman Intentions for like the last seven, eight years since 2013, so about seven years, my girlfriend Chrissy got me interested in, into the moon phases. Actually, my mom made a comment once about that time, about 2013, that, you know, women in ancient times used to track their period cycle with the phases of the moon. So I thought that was interesting. So I started paying attention and I noticed that my period cycle did sync with the moon. So that kind of was like, um, one of the things that started me paying attention to, you know, the different phases of the moon and what was going on and stuff and then setting new moon intentions and doing some cleansing on a full moon and introspection and stuff like that. So, um, but I got a, my Lunarly subscription box and I just wanted to show you guys what came in it this time. It's all beautifully packaged. Everything's adorable in here. <clears throat> I've been using all of this stuff because I opened it on Christmas. Um, so it's not like a real unboxing because <clears throat> I've seen everything in here. But December was the cold moon. Black tea, violet, and ode. Hand poured candle for intention setting. 60 hour burn time. It's super adorable too because on the other side it has a relaxing candle meditation which I've heard of before and I have done mostly when I've done tarot cards and stuff. Um, but this is really cute because, you know, it's just sharing it with more people that don't know. So it says place candle three to six feet away, light flame and dim lights, sit upright and gaze into the flame. Use the scent as your anchor to the present moment. And this candle smells freaking amazing. I got my husband a candle for Christmas and it was crap. It was so bad. It stunk. I ordered it online because actually he has a Pinterest so I was looking at his wish list and he had a candle pinned. I ordered it and we smelt it and it was like kind of really gross. It's called Sherlock's study or something. <clears throat> Might be growing on me, but I don't know. So, it smells so good. I need somewhere to put this. Okay, so the next thing I saw was, I opened this adorable, adorable, adorable little velvet bag. This one here. And inside is just a little lunarly card and it says how to use. Add a few drops of your favorite essential oil, reapply oils every couple of days. And this freaking necklace, I love it so much. I've been wearing it every day. Is a lava stone with a little delicate little gold chain for essential oils. How stinking cute is that? I'm obsessed with essential oils too. I love essential oils. I think I have lavender and northern lights black spruce going right now. Anyway, so my necklace is freaking adorable. And then the next thing I saw was um, Breathe Easy Guru Nanda 100% Pure and Natural Essential Oil Synergy Blend called Breathe Easy. 
I was like, I'm not sure if I'm gonna like this or not because I do really like Young Loving Essential Oils, but I smelt it and it smells really good. And some of the stuff on the boxing says like cruelty-free, no synthetic ingredients, third-party verified, non-GMO, pure eucalyptus. Wow. Beauty and the Beast is really loud. So when I opened the box, I was like, all of this stuff is really cute, but I was a little bit bummed out because I saw in the advertisement, um, someone had a, a plant and I'm like really obsessed with plants. So I was a little bummed that I didn't have a plant. And then I saw this too and it was like, breathe easy. It's kind of like a cold. I was like, oh, they probably put it in there because you know, it's cold season in the middle of December and I wasn't sick. And then the next day I got sick. So I was like super relieved that I had it. it smells so good. It's got oregano in it too, which is really good for your immune system. So that is called Heal. That's the essential oil. The next thing I opened was this and I got a little crystal. This is a Malawi agate, a Malawi agate. It's beautiful and like the coloring makes it like look like it's got a little heart right there in the middle. So stinking cute. It has this little card in here telling you about everything that's in your thing. So obviously the essential oil diffuser necklace, the breathe easy, 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 breathe easy essential oil. Oh no, this went down. Malawi agate. I've never heard of this before I got it. So it says the Malawi agate is the perfect stone to connect with during this important restorative moon. It's believed to instill deep stability within the spirit that offers both peace and strength. And it says, when you're feeling stressed or anxious, hold the Malawi agate to calm the mind and settle the spirit. Let it ground you with its reassuring and relaxing energy. <sighs> so the, this new moon was the cold moon. It really does relax me. It's crazy. <clears throat> and then the other thing I thought when I opened this box was I was like, yeah, I do like all that stuff, but I probably really won't use it with my new moon intention. But then I was just like, you know what? Let me just try it the way, you know, they they put it together and I did. So two more things. So I think because it was my first box, I got this um, journal in it. And oh, also another card about the cold moon. So this journal has like all of the different, the first quarter moon, full moon, the next new moon. And there's like a bunch of pages that you're supposed to, you know, write down what moon it was. And it walks you through like setting an intention, which I thought was really cute. And I actually used it this time around. Usually I'll just kind of do my own thing. Um, but I did use the prompts and the questions um, that they had in the front of this too make my intention, which I'm not gonna share because, I don't know, it's kind of personal since it's still the current new moon, so maybe I'll share it after um, this cycle ends. Yeah, so that was the journal. The card about the cold moon, it, you can probably look it up, December 25th, 2019, cold moon, lunarly, like I don't really wanna share all of their stuff with everybody, so. But I'm sure you can Google search like what the cold moon means. And then the last thing was the sleepy time naturally vein sleepy time sleep serum it is it says apply directly to the skin or use in the shower for a silky soft feel and it's lavender and i'm recording backwards um it says it's vegan not tested on animals and uses desired for massage apply directly to skin or use in the shower and it's from canada i think this actually i think the whole company is from canada lunarly shout me out i want to work with you guys smells so good so yeah so that's everything and then that night I um put my necklace on put the oils on wrote down my intention lit my candle and then you know sat with my Malawi agate and now um in my morning and evening routine I've been incorporating the stuff that I got in the subscription box so every morning I'm using the breathe easy to kind of wake me up because there's a lot of peppermint and eucalyptus in in that blend so it really helps like wake me up and invigorate me in the morning and then I just have a card that I wrote my intention down on. Um, it's actually the gift tag from my husband for this box. So cute, it's a little fox. So I read my intention after I put my oils on. And then in the evening, I use the sleepy time oil and light my candle again and read my intention. So that's it. That is this unboxing video. I hope you liked it. Um, definitely look up Lunarly. I really recommend them. 
and let me know if you got a cold moon box did you get the same thing that I did like I'm kind of curious I assume they would send everybody the same thing but I don't know so let me know in the comments and like and subscribe again um Andrea with Moms on a Mission have a wonderful and beautiful day